What's good, YouTube? This your boy Chi World back at y'all again with another video. Today we're gonna be going through some of the comments of the love and support I've been getting on YouTube, and we're gonna be answering a lot of questions on here as well. So, without further ado, let's jump right into this video. Let's jump right into this thing. Laughing my off is already lit. You know what I'm saying? The only way I know is lit. So you know what I'm saying? So every video. That's why if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do that, man. You know what I'm saying? Your boy only dropping the lit visuals. The lit video. You feel You feel your tips are amazing, bro. Helps me a lot. Thanks and like, and you got a new subscriber. You know what I'm saying? Thank you, man, for subscribing to the channel, man. There's no Chi World without you. Thank you. I've been trying to color on Illustrator, but had so much trouble. You know what I'm saying? And that's what, you know what I'm saying? That's what the videos are for, man. I'm trying to help keep you out of trouble. You feel me? So I'm going to drop more videos. So yeah, so you won't be in no trouble. Boom o'clock. You feel me? Okay. I'm gonna have to come back to this one. I need, uh, I need to translate for that one. You feel me? But I know it's all love, man. So you know what I'm saying. Even though your boy don't know what it said, but I do know what the illustrator is. It's all love, dog. I know you was trying to say something nice to me. It's just that I'm so damn motherfucking ignorant. I can't understand what you're saying. Can you do a video on all your pen options and more tips? Feel jump to that now. Show you what's up. Look, the only thing you need to know about your brush, come right here. If you got a tablet like what I got, if you're using something like this, that's what we have here. I know my hands are ashy. Look, you want to come up to here, set your brush. Let me see. Okay. Put this over here so y'all can see it. Go to fix pressure put this on four or five put on five put these two on five or four if you put four right here put four right there. they got they gotta be a, the same number click okay come to your brush and now you got the only lines your boy use in illustrator now if you want to get your lines more smoother, just click your brush. And after you double click the brush icon, it'll pull up this chart which we have here. And you can go, you can bring the fidelity up, you can, I mean, bring it down, or you can make it more smoother. Like the, the more you bring it up, the more it'll try to correct your lines. You know what I'm saying? And the more you bring it down, the more control you will have over your lines. See what I'm saying? So it'll keep most of your flaws, the lower you got it. And that's all you need to know about your brush. And change the size of it. Like if you want to make it thicker, you just come right here. But the brush stays the same. I never change my brush. I use the same brush. Made that. Never change your brush, just change the size <clears throat> or the fidelity, and that's it. I've been looking for a tutorial I can follow. Finally, this helps a lot. Not too deep in explaining, but has everything I've been trying to learn to do. Great vid. Thanks, man. Thank you, dog. You feel me? You, you know what I'm saying? I don't try to go over your head with it. That's why I make it simple so you can understand it. Good job, bro. I've been thinking about getting an illustrator pair myself. So, thank you for the sub, man. Real talk. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Amazing. If you heard a big crack, that was my jaw, which popped on the desk while watching. Thank you, man. You know what I'm saying? Stuff like that, it really mean a lot to me. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. You feel me? Awesome, man. Nice and clean. Great tips. Subscribe. I appreciate you for subscribing, man. You know what I'm saying? You just 
became a part of this family, man. We on the rise. We on the rise like the sun. You feel me? Like and subscribe. I really enjoyed the whole video, man. I'm glad you sat through the whole thing. Because sometimes I, after I edit it, I go back and watch it. I be like, damn. You know what I'm saying? That was kind of kind kind of boring. You feel me? But you know what I'm saying? You sat through it. That ain't number love. Which brushes do you use? I only use one brush, but I often change the size of it. But yeah, I only use one brush, and that's the after you set the pen pressure to the brush in Illustrator. I don't ever switch it up. I don't do nothing special to it. I just set the pressure sensitivity on the brush. And I change the size, like I make it bigger or I make it smaller, just depends on what I'm doing with it. You feel me? Nice work, bro. Also, Chi World smashed it. Bruh. Pause, bro. No, we got <laughs> pause. <laughs> Appreciate the love and support, man. I'm just, I'm just, just goofy. I'm goofy, dog. I know you ain't mean no homo stuff. I design too, bro, but I use Photoshop. Watching this just made me want to permanently switch to Illustrator. Illustrator seems way easier to use. I'm inspired by your work. Keep it up. Man, I appreciate you, man. That's what's up. Don't permanently stop using Photoshop because there's a lot of pros and cons that Photoshop can do that Illustrator can't. So Illustrator is more if you're trying to get some clean line work and Photoshop is more of a natural feel like if you're trying to really get into depth and some fine detail with like watercolors. Like if you want to feel like you really acrylic painting or shades. That's what Photoshop for. You can really like do a lot with it. So the best I would do if I was you, I would learn how to use Illustrator and learn how to cross platform. I use both of those programs together. You know what I'm saying? So it's good to know how to use both. Don't just completely stop one for the other because it's a lot that this program won't be able to do, but the other one will be able to. But I appreciate you for the love and support, man. Real talk real talk your feels me yes mate thanks for the isolation tips you're welcome my brother phenomenal tutorial i mean like thank you so much nah man thank you dog thank you bro, bro. real talk thank you for watching this video needs more likes go on get me more likes then man go on share this thing Share with your friends, your mama, your auntie, your daddy, your brother, sister, cousin, auntie, dog, nephew. Go on, share that vi share this video so we can get this thing more likes, man. I appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? Awesome. I just got my Wacom tablet, and it's really inspiring to see what's possible. I like your style. Thanks for the tutorial. You welcome, man. Appreciate you for, you know what I'm saying, watching your boy and thinking I'm dope enough to get some inspiration from you feel me thanks for making this boss tutorial you know what i'm saying you know bosses do what bosses does it's a lot great help for me also really dope work man keep it rolling you know i'm gonna keep the wheel rolling on that thing you feel me you know what i'm saying pimping is what pimping does you feel me i got to awesome i really enjoyed this i'm glad you enjoyed it that's why i made it i made it for you guys to enjoy it watch it learn something from it you feel you just got yourself a new subscriber you have no idea how much this helps much love man thank you man i'm glad i can help you feel me i'm glad your boy can help and you feel me is one of my favorite words so i gave you the you feel me excellent work man thanks for sharing and that's all I can do, man. You know what I'm saying? Share the knowledge. If I know something, I'm going to share it. I hope y'all learn some tips about Illustrator or any program you see me using on my channel. Go on, drop some knowledge. You know what I'm saying? If you see something I can be doing better, go on, share with you, boy, man. I like learning, too. You know what I'm saying? That's what that's what's the process of getting better and getting greater is about. It's about learning how to perfect your craft learning how to use the tools that you got available to you 
Awesome, thanks for this. I find in a lot of other tutorials, people talk too fast or they don't explain what they're clicking on or what tools to use. You explain everything. You know what I'm saying? I try, man. I try. Why I can't choose the pressure options on my brush? Right here, if you got a tablet like what I got, if you're using something like this, that's what we have here. I know my hands ash. Look. You want to come up to here, set your brush. Let me see. Okay. Put this over here so y'all can see it. Go to fix, pressure. Put this on four or five. Put on five. Put these two on five or four. If you put four right here, put four right here. They got to be the same number. This was the only video that actually helped. I'm glad this was the only video that really helped you, you feel me? Because I ain't just making them just to not help you. I'm making them to help you. I'm trying to help you. Amazing. Thank you, man. You amazing for leaving that. Amazing art job. Thanks, bro. Can then a calligraphy pressure brush be used with an iPad Pro Apple Pencil? Yeah, you can. You can use a pressure sensitivity brush with your iPad, with your iPad Pro. And my favorite program to use on the iPad Pro is called Procreate. So you should go and check that out if you're trying to get them same strokes you be seeing me get on Illustrator. It's, it's pretty much pretty much achieve the same thing. So yeah, go on, go and check out Procreate if you got an iPad Pro and you're trying to get them same lines where you can go thicker to the thin lines you know what I'm saying the same almost the same lines I use on Adobe Illustrator it's pretty much the same thing thanks for all the tips now all I need is a pen and tablet and the Apple all the lessons you said is my first time trying to digital art so wish me luck man I wish you more than luck man so all you gotta do is go at it with a clear mind, make sure you got some fresh ideas, stay at it, and you will get better, man. You just gotta stick with it. You probably gonna hate it at first, cause when I first started using Illustrator, I was like, man, this program, it's just too complicated. But then after a while, you will start getting the hang of it and it'll become just, just simple to you. You're insane, you feel me? I'm glad somebody know, you feel me? I'm glad somebody noticed I'm insane, man. I'm crazy, I'm crazy, you feel me? I'm just out there. I appreciate you, man. I know what you mean. Dude, this helped a lot. Subscribe. I'm glad you subscribe, man. I hope everybody who come in and subscribe to the channel, please go ahead. If you haven't subscribed to your boy, do that now. I will not let you down. That stroke, though, you feel me? I've been working on the stroke. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I'm something like, I'm something like Steph Curry with the stroke. You feel me? I might just, you feel me? I wish it was more of us doing tutorials like this. Dope. Let's make more of us then out there. Let's create more folks doing tutorials like this. Because we need more tutorials like this. In the art society, man. We need more people to drop tutorials like this. I appreciate you, man. Appreciate you. Your work is incredible. Punt not intended. When somebody say a punt not intended. The punt not intended. <laughs> you meant it. Okay. Punt not intended, but I don't understand why you have to lock layers or why you only lock the black line work within a layer. Okay, the reason I lock the black line work inside the layer, so just say if I wanted to delete something, but it's, it's a tight spot to get into and it's kind of complicated and I always make a mistake and click my black line work too I lock that layer so it'll exit out the equation so if I'm trying to delete certain colors I don't want it uh not delete my line work that's why I lock the line work so so I won't touch it anytime I'm trying to work around it if I'm if I just got a if I'm in a tight situation I lock it so I won't make a mistake and click it you definitely look high I am loving it why I gotta be high, man? Why can't I just be lit naturally? Why can't I just be that? Huh? Answer me that. Super dope. Keep it up, bro. You know I'm gonna keep it up, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because your boy been down for so long. And I got to keep it up. We got to keep it up. Uh, another echelon. You feel me? 
You dope, bro, for real. You got a new subscriber and follower. I'm a video illustrator and a graphic designer, but trying to dabble in paint and drawing. You got talent for real, and I learned something new. Check me out if you got some time. Keep the grind up. Babe, I'm going to check you out, bro, and see what you got, man. I appreciate you for the love and support, man. It's just some advice to you. Stay doing your thing. Stay grinding, man. We need more people out here that just create, man. We need that in the world. We need a lot of creators to show their perspective of what they see in life. You know what I'm saying? Because we all got something great to bring to the table, I feel. Damn, this is lit. You know you boy lit. My nigga, new subscriber from the first second. You a real one, dog. That's all we need. That's all we need to. We just need a second to see. Okay, is is he is he really is he is he real? You know what I'm saying? Like I can tell if you real in a second, dog. You know what I'm saying? So real, recognize real. All you needed was a second. You know what I'm saying? I made that second count. You feel me? Much love to you, dog. Appreciate you. Awesome, man. It's lit. I'm always lit, man. I should. My nickname should be Chi World Lit. You feel me? Chi World Lit. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm only from now on we gonna make these videos lit. The end of my line is still very round. I had that same problem, and what I did was I reinstalled my driver. And I didn't have that problem no more. So maybe you need to delete the driver you got to your tablet and then reinstall it. Because sometimes I had that problem with it. Just like as soon as you make the line, it'll just have like this big old blob of ink. So you just got to uninstall, reinstall, and then eventually that should fix your problem. Because it, fix, it fixed mine. I had that same problem. Can you tell me how to change my outline from gray to black? Okay, how you change your outline from gray to black, what you do, you wanna highlight everything. Select your line where it makes sure you got everything highlighted. And then while you got everything still highlighted, go to your color wheel and move it to black. And that should change it from gray to black. How do you get the brush to not post correct it? I followed your other brush preset tutorials, but after I make a line purposely squiggly, it'll straighten it out a little bit. So, if you don't want your brush to get, if you don't want it to help you straighten your line so much, all you gotta do, you double click the brush icon. It'll pull up this chart, which we have here. And you can go, you can bring the fidelity up, you can, I mean, bring it down, or you can make it more smoother. One of the best artists of the year. Man, that's what's so glad you feel that way about me. Dope, dude. You know what I'm saying, no, you dope. I ain't dope. You dope. You dope for saying that. You are an inspiration. Keep up. Thank you, bro. Thank you. I'm glad, I, I'm, glad I'm an inspiration. A lot of these comments man these just reading these comments for real it really it really motivate me man it really motivate me to be the best i can be you know what i'm saying so i appreciate all the good energy all the comments that i miss i appreciate those too and it just really made me feel good about what i'm doing man like, i really got a passion for art being creative whether it's painting making music making beats shooting visuals it all tie in that's just creating being an artist and i really appreciate folks appreciating what i do and that's love because everything nice that y'all are saying y'all don't have to tell me anything so with that and taking that into consideration i really appreciate it like when i say i appreciate everybody who left a comment i don't care if it was bad a great it's all the same like you took the time out your day to write me something you know what i'm saying so i really appreciate y'all if you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up leave your comments down below and if this video do good i will go in to more i will go into more detail with the next one i'll make sure 
I cover a lot more comments that's left because it's a lot of them I make sure I answer. I go through and I make sure I just grab nothing but the questions on the video. I appreciate y'all. Stay tuned. I'm out.